What is going on guys? Crow2119 20, coming at you with a little update on the Crow Studios here. So how you guys doing to myself so today? I'm here to inform you about the progress of Punisher Target Locked. So it's just like, this video is almost similar as to what happened with uh, Blade vs. Deadpool. Except it has nothing to do with injury. It mainly has to do with open availability. Uh, me and my friends who have been working on this film for quite some time. Uh, you know we got a lot of progress done you know we started the, we started beginning and then we got to the middle and then we got close to the end and then as soon as we hit the last scene it all started falling apart pretty much what i'm saying in that sense is that um uh, production on this film has come to a temporary cease um that that's not saying that it's canceled completely it's just implying that there's a lot going on uh, basically, in a nutshell, I'll explain it to you. We have work, lots and lots of work. <laughs> I work at a I work at a at a Taco Bell recently, and you know you gotta make money where you gotta make it because sometimes you don't you gotta you gotta work jobs that you never wanted to work before, and you just gotta make do with what you got. Unfortunately, that's the case. And you know it, it, this this job's been pretty good to me, um, considering I've become champ of the week. I've been the most reliable worker, and. Honestly, it's like a, it's actually a really good job for me. It's really steady. It's comfortable And I don't think I could really find a better job that could do that if I do I mean hey I'd be happy to hop onto that one But you know on top of that I also do other side jobs like landscaping and stuff like that Just to make an extra couple bucks here and there just so that way it's uh, beneficial to me and the channel and so on and so forth with that also, I'm trying to uh, Mix things up a little with the channel if I haven't implied this at all. I, I'm pretty sure I didn't um, what I'm doing in the, in the matter of when, while this pause is going on with Punisher Target Locked, I'm going to be making short skits because I feel that my channel needs more content and I just don't have enough. All I have mainly of is more trailers than actual movies and when I make movies they're not exactly the way that I've wanted to make them. I feel like I could do so much better in that, in that sense. Um, pretty much what I'm trying to say is that the little skits that I want to make are such as like a John Wick film or the Dead by Daylight Chronicles, which you guys have obviously seen. Um, we are going to be making the Agent of uh, Hydra video, but that comes way later after the Revengers, and I will explain more about the Revengers uh, soon, just I would like to get through all this first. I also have plans for a skit regards to uh, the Predator, uh, because that's one of my favorite movie characters, and possibly another little Bounty Hunter skit, uh, which case kind of talks about a time before the final moments of the bounty hunter um and those are all going to be coming out sometime soon i'd hope i would like to get the john wick out as soon as possible same with the chronicles of uh, Day dead by daylight because we've been working really hard on getting all this stuff together for these things and now that we actually have them we have to just get off our butts and get out there and do the fucking film back onto the topic at hand with the puncher target lot pretty much how many scenes do we have to do in order to complete the entire film well we have the final scene which is a final battle scene uh, we have yet to get all the actors that we need for the scene all together in one spot on the same day that nobody is working so that we can film the actual scene. And that's becoming a really big problem because some of us live in Flint, some of us live in St. Charles, and some of us live in Freeland, and some of us live in Saginaw, Michigan. So it's kind of hard to really get together when everybody lives in a different city and we all work on days that we don't work but we do work, which is really hard to, go, to like you know grasp the concept of frustration the amount of frustration that we've obtained from this entire production it's pretty hard i'd say in, in comparison to deadpool uh blade versus deadpool this is equally um frustrating considering it's just not going anywhere so i figured why should i just not do any more films on the side when while this is just on pause um so yeah we have the last final scene along with a couple end credit scenes that we have to do uh, one of them's already done, just need to make the final two after that, and the whole film is pretty much done. Um, as far as Revengers go, and I know a lot of people have been asking about that. Uh, what's the story? What's going on? What's the main villain? Who is all part of the team with certain people not being a part of your cast anymore? And you know what? I, I think I can finally talk about it. Is the Revengers going to be done this summer? I want to say yes. I really do. But with the fact of the production on the, on the uh, Punisher target lock not being finished, we have to not make the Revengers yet until something actually gives and we can finish Punisher Target Locked. Otherwise, the story that it leads into with the Revengers will not make sense. And I'm pretty sure out of everybody who watches films, they do want continuity 
Eris to not be present and they want it to make sense. So in which case I'm working very hard to make sure the Revengers is absolutely perfect and it delivers the emotions that I'm trying to get out there and make sure that the story is as easily, easily driven as maybe Endgame. Because Endgame was my, my, my one of my most favorite films of 2019 honestly and its story was pretty amazing and it drove me to make my story even better so I worked even harder to make sure that the script was good. I even did rewrites because I didn't like how the original was looking. So I can't really give an exact um, answer on if the Revengers is going to be done this summer. They might not even be done until next summer and I might have to push that and I really don't want to have to but in order to like you know make things work it's probably the best thing to do at this point considering it's going to be the biggest production I've ever made when it comes to making films and that's the whole idea. So I just wanted to make this small update on what's going on in the channel. Um, that's pretty much all of it. Um, but uh, uh, at the end, of, let's make this end of the video a little shout out. Uh, go ahead and check out Nugus. If you know who that is, that is my old friend Brittany from high school that we used to make videos with uh, about trailers and stuff like that. She's back on YouTube. Um, she's doing better for, for herself, I can see. And uh, I just wanted to show my support. Uh, I'll leave her channel description in the, the fucking link in the description box below. And uh, go and check her out. Uh, give her some support. Um, I would hope that I, I used to like watching her content all the time. Well, considering I was a part of it, but um, mainly besides that, um, I loved her content since she started, um, and I hope she does good for herself. So, Brittany, if you're watching this, the shout outs to you. Um, go check out Nugus like, again. Links in the description box below. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little video. Uh, please go check out The Crow Show. I've been uploading on that a little bit more lately. If you don't want to wait for more videos to come out on this channel, go ahead and check out that channel again. Channel link in the description box below. And go ahead and check it out for yourself. But in the meantime, I'm going to go ahead and make sure that I work extra, extra hard for you guys so we can get this content rolling. And we will make sure that we are back in the next video. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all.